Garbo and welcome to my channel. I'm currently 25 years old, living in Montreal, just moved from Toronto, and uh, we made handmade ceramics here. It's called Grumpy Kid Studio, merch plug, merch plug, launching soon. And let me show you some of the mugs we make. So this one here is a holographic drippy mug with a speckle on the inside. And this is a collaboration mug we made with Peace Collective coming out really soon. Mental health matters. And then there's also this one, a fan favorite. It's called the Grumpkin, the Grumpy Pumpkin. We launched La Halloween last year. It's super cute. So yes, this is my studio space here in Montreal. I'll be showing you my first week of living here in this video and I'm building the studio from scratch to what I have now. In this channel, I hope to show you all the ups and downs of running a small business, about the business side of things and also tips and tricks about pottery, of course, because we are a pottery business. And that's pretty much it. Hope you enjoy and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and turn on, turn on notification bell. Whew, see you soon. everything I got and I'm starving let's go home I finally made this back to the studio there are a couple more things on the floor but I'm going to do a haul very soon okay, we're at Home Depot so guess what I'm buying all of it again yay guess how much this cart cost me it's a lot more than what Ikea cost me that's what I can tell you Okay, we're back into the car. We're going to drive back to the studio, drop everything off, and um, trying to install them this afternoon. I know I'm pretty short. That's why I got a three-step ladder, but um, we shall see how that goes. Maybe I'll eat my lunch in the car just because I'm so tired. Anywho, see you later. Okay, so we have a problem. They charged me 79 brackets instead of 29, so I have to go back and get this sorted. I was almost at my studio, but I have to drive back to, you know, Deal with this so great day it's a great day everybody so that was easy they refund me 427 dollars let's go back to the studio now day two in the studio So there's a lot of work that needs to be done still. I have two kiln over there. This one I brought it from my parents' garage and it was pretty enough for me at the time. But look at the size comparison. This is the old kiln I got from an old, a potter somewhere more east and I still have to figure out how to set that up but that's the kiln station and here will be more of a photo shoot and a free floating flexible storage section. And here will be more of the 3D printing uh, mold station. So this area over here is going to be the main working area. We're thinking to have some tables for people to interact and um, come here to enjoy some time with us and this wall is going to be full of shelves eventually and that's a sink and we're going to talk about that later so. Since I have it here, why not give you a little haul and show you what I got this morning at the Eco Depot in Montreal. <laughs> I realized the drill bit that I needed, I didn't get it. So instead of doing that wall, I made a shelf. And I guess today we're just going to keep making shelves. Now what I'm going to do is install the same shelf over there, but put it here. And here will be more of a flexible area where I'll take photos or just move things around. Okay, so it's the end of the night. I'm about to leave. It's 9 o'clock and um, I definitely didn't do as much as I wanted, but I built that little clay organization. I mean, glaze organization shelf there. 
two shelves here for miscellaneous stuff. I've decided I want to put my casting table, which I still have to make back there. And here's going to be a flexible photo shoot area here. Not sure, maybe just plants. Move these over and put a bunch of plants in the corner. And ugh, <laughs> later problem. And this huge shelf that I built for all the kiln equipment. And also I'll put the same one over there for my packing supplies. <laughs> So I'll install all the vertical tracks, horizontal ones. I'm just missing a little bit of the last bit of the horizontal track because the last one, I still want it to be another shelf here, but I don't want to buy a full length horizontal track because as you can see, this is where I'm going to put my other shelf. So I need to go back to Home Depot tomorrow again and um, buy more of those horizontal tracks. And I think it's looking pretty good. We just need to put all the anchors up there and there and the spacing, I'm still trying to figure out how much I should space them apart but that's that almost done getting there Friday hey. Hey. Loser are going to work bye bye, bye, -bye. so pretty hey I have one working kiln with a pretty nasty plastic melt over it but we have one kiln working Okay, so it's still a little bit of a mess, but it's okay, I just need to clean it up. But today the main goal is to deal with this somehow. So I'm just trying to figure out what kind of tools I need and then see if there's anything I'm missing. And then I'm going to go and grab some at, I don't know, Rona or Home Depot or whatever. Okay, so I'm very confused about that part, but the thing is the person that sold me the kiln gave me a little instruction on how to install it back. But the thing is, this kiln looks a little bit more uh, well-loved than the one that they show here, which is super shiny. Okay, we have some progress. So the whole box is mounted back on the kiln, which is step number one. Step number two, is to figure out what these are. Look, this is what a new kiln is supposed to look like, shiny, other than these I need to wipe off. So yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna have a call with the kiln person. And for the rest of the day, I'm just going to unpack all the boxes, clean things up and take it easy. Friday night activity, drinking tea for my grumpy mug while browsing for used furniture on Facebook Marketplace. This one is actually pretty nice should I get it? it's only a hundred dollars actually pretty intrigued hmm let me know in the comments I'm gonna put you on YouTube I'm gonna put you on YouTube no you can't I'm going to put him on YouTube going to get brunch or something thanks for the insta husband huh you're the instagram husband yep Wow, my tree is ugly. Or we can just be like this. This is. We got our hot dog. I love you. Do we find me? Choo! It's so warm, too. It's pretty nice here. Absolutely perfect team. We're on our way to see an applicant to be a studio assistant. So what a beautiful day and happy Sunday everyone. Okay, I gotta walk faster because I'm running late already. Whew. 
so nice here in Montreal. We found the cafe. It's so cute. Can't wait to see her. See you guys tomorrow when it's when it's Monday. It's to, yeah, tomorrow's Monday. Okay, see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Happy Monday! So I just went to pick up a bunch of wood pieces. I have no idea what these are, so let's take a quick look. <laughs> So let's count how many we got. So we got 4, 8, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18. That's nice. We're in the car and now time to go back to the studio and move all of this back. You can do this! I mean, I can do this because you're just watching this. But thanks for watching. Click like and comment and subscribe or notification bell or whatever YouTubers say. Back to the studio yet, we have to pick up some electrical stuff from Addison. Let's go! I got exactly what I need. Okay, we're back to the studio. I'm exhausted. And we're back to this. I need to pick up some stuff from my car so I can start fixing the rest of this. Do you want to know? Extra percent, new killers, shot. So we just fixed the thermal couple for this little kiln and now this is brand new. Just need to clean up the bottom and it's ready to go again. <laughs> yes, I'm still not on the big kiln yet, but baby steps, baby steps. I really hope that by the end of this, I'll become an expert in kilns. So if you have any kiln questions, don't ask me. Morning! I'm on my way to see another applicant for the studio assistant position so I can't wait to show you what she's like and returning some stuff I got a hot dog for lunch and a coffee a really really cheap decided where to hang them yet so I'm just gonna leave them around the shelf here and they're looking so cute okay back to work bon appetit tonight's the last night we'll be in our old apartment so we're eating out in our neighborhood moving tomorrow <laughs> Bye.